Hello parents, welcome to your guide for fostering early literacy at home, preparing your little ones for the exciting world of pre-kindergarten. In the comfort of your own home, you have the power to cultivate not only their academic skills, but also to contribute to their social and emotional growth. We're here to guide you through this meaningful journey. Let's delve into how we can make this process natural, engaging, and effective right where you are, in the heart of your child's learning environment, home. Let's begin with phonemic awareness. Encouraging activities such as rhyming games, clapping syllables, or identifying beginning sounds and words all contribute to developing phonemic awareness in an enjoyable, stress-free way. Now we're on to alphabetic principles. This refers to the understanding that letters and letter patterns represent the sounds of spoken language. So, reading alphabet books, playing with letter magnets, and engaging in writing activities can all naturally expose children to the alphabetic principle. Now, we're moving on to phonological awareness. Phonics at home can be taught through a variety of engaging activities, such as matching sounds to letters, writing exercises, and even interactive online games. And here we are, early writing exposure. Encouraging early writing experiences is crucial for children's literacy development. This might involve drawing shapes, scribbling, forming letters, or eventually writing their own name. And all of these activities help young kids understand that written words represent ideas and can convey meaning. And it also aids in their fine motor skill development and introduces them to the concept of written communication. How exciting is to read aloud for young children? Regularly reading aloud to children is an effective way to expose them to language and foster a love of reading. It allows them to hear the rhythm of language, expand their vocabulary, and improve their comprehension skills. Providing a language-rich environment that stimulates curiosity and learning, this could involve anything from exploring diverse books to having thoughtful discussions about stories or participating in interactive reading activities. Exposing your children to these effective strategies at home can better prepare them to read the high frequency words they will encounter during the later part of the year in pre-K. High frequency words are the list of words they will encounter every day in reading and writing. So, teachers group them as hard words, sight words, and flash words. Sight words, also known as high frequency words, are commonly used words that young children are encouraged to recognize instantly. They include words like I and see and the and my. Hard words have irregular spellings and they don't match their sounds. Making phonics-based decoding hard, kids should memorize them to boost reading fluency. And flash words are high frequency words that are decodable. They follow the standard spelling rules so children can use their understanding of phonics to sound them out. These are words like cat, dog, sit, run, and man. Last but not least, remember, every child learns at their own pace, and it's okay if they're not mastering everything right away. What matters most is providing a supportive, engaging, and nurturing environment. With your love and guidance, they'll be ready for kindergarten in no time. Good luck, parents. We're cheering for you and your little ones on this beautiful journey. Stay tuned for more helpful tips and tricks, and until then, keep learning and growing together.